Welcome back to The Reading Corner with Mrs. G. For more great stories and books, subscribe here and give me a thumbs up for like it. Now this is not a story, but it's a book that shows some tales. So you're going to look at the tale and guess what animal has that tale. Who has this tale? All right, so see if you can guess what animal and it belongs to what tail. So here's the first one. Who has this tail? Can you guess what animal has this tail? A spider monkey has this tail. A spider monkey uses its tail to hang on to branches. All right, next one. Who has this tail? Do you know? Some of you do. A rattlesnake has this tail. A rattlesnake uses its tail to warn its enemies. Who has this tail? Do you know it? A shark has this tail. A shark uses its tail to push itself through the water. Next one, who has this tail? Actually, it's a very small animal. A gerbil has this tail. A gerbil uses its tail to balance on its back legs. Next one, who has this tail? Oh, I bet you know this one. Know this one? A horse has this tail. A horse uses its tail to flick away flies. Who has this tail? Ooh, do you know that one? A scorpion has this tail. A scorpion uses its tail to sting its prey. Ah, who has this tail? That's pretty, isn't it? A peacock has this tail. A peacock uses its tail to attract a mate. Who has this tail? An arctic fox has this tail. An arctic fox uses its tail to stay, stay warm when it sleeps. Who has this tail? A beaver has this tail. A beaver uses its tail to steer in the water. Oh, that's all of them. Okay, so who has these tails? We have these tails. There you go. <laughs> that was kind of fun. Did, so how many of them did you get right? Did you figure out who, what animal belonged to each tail? All right. So check back. We'll see you next time for a great story in the Reading Corner with Mrs. G.